you know, grew up very undersized, very small, didn't really take, you know, lifting anything like that seriously. So um, in high school, I was five, going into my senior year, 5'8", 130, 140 pounds, something like that. Um, so I didn't get a whole lot of looks uh, for colleges, for baseball and anything. Um, and when Webster University was one of the few, or really the only one that reached out to me and was serious about me coming to them um, and playing for them. So decided to go with Webster as local and I kind of wanted to stay local anyway. Um, so I thought it was a perfect fit. Um, and freshman year comes by and uh, I had a pretty good freshman year. Um, you know, I hit 90 miles an hour for the first time, which, you know, leading up till then, I don't, I don't think I even hit 86 or 85 really. So it was a big jump and a big shock to me. Um, and after my freshman year, my coach came up to me and was like, hey, like you can make a career out of this, like, but you got to work for it, you got to work hard, you got to change your diet, everything like that. So that summer going into sophomore year, um, my diet plan changed, my weightlifting plan changed, um, put on around 30 to 35 pounds um, in that summer. Um, so going into sophomore year, is about 6'2", 190, 195. Um, and from then on, it was I was more consistent with my fastball and my you know my velocity. It was 88 to 91, 92 um, for sophomore year. Junior year comes by, and it was you know 90, 92, touching three, touching four. Um, and sure enough, you know every every game that I was throwing in, there were scouts there. There was the whole stands were pretty much scouts. There wasn't anyone but scouts and some parents. Um, so it was just I mean it was crazy going through that. Um, and, and sure enough, that, that summer I got drafted in the fifth round by the race.